Hey everybody. Hello, I'm Kim. And I'm Erin and we are K&E RV TV. If you are new to our channel, welcome. We are best friends who live full time in our RV and travel and we are currently here in New Hampshire. Mm -hmm. And today, we're here for the Sunflower Festival. Sunflower Festival, we're in Lee, New Hampshire and I'm so excited to see some fun sunflowers. Yes, we're here at Copple House Farms mm -hmm. in Lee, New Hampshire and they um, have this festival every year. They do have different times. You can come during the week. They also have weekends. They do a um, blooms and booze day. Mm. And they also do a sunset time to check out the sunflowers. And this festival is every year, but we're here during the week. And it's mm -hmm. Tuesday, um, yeah, August work, 1st. <laughs> yeah, August 1st we work on weekends. So uh, we are pretty happy that this festival is open during the week yeah. too. And hopefully it won't be as crowded. Yeah, exactly. They mm -hmm. know for the weekends they do do live music. They have crafts, um, a craft fair, different food trucks and things like that. During the week they don't have as much going on. Mm -hmm. But we're here for the sunflowers. So that's all, it's all good with me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's go have some fun. Let's do it. We are Kim and Aaron, and this is Zach and Cody. We are best friends living and traveling full time in our renovated RV, Lucy. We have been on the road since October 2020, so please subscribe to join in on all the fun. RVTV, K and E RVTV, sing it with us. We are, we're being greeted. Hello. Are you part of the welcome committee? <laughs> Hi. Hi. You want to say hi to YouTube? Oh, we literally just did our intro right here. <laughs> Hi. Oh yeah. <laughs> maybe he wants. To, maybe he wants to give us a tour. I don't have any food for you. I'm sorry. <laughs> you want to give us a tour today? Here, can you? Which way to the sunflowers? It's our first time here. Which way? <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, let's go. All right. So, emissions is right here to this oh. barn. Come on, let's go. So they do Look. have um, some prices listed over here. Now, if you know the day that you're coming and you're able to purchase um, your pass online via credit card or electronic payment, we do advise that you do it um, at least 12 a.m. the day before you're planning to go. You can purchase ahead of time and it saves you a few dollars. I think purchasing online for during the week was $8 mm -hmm. and then here at the farm it's 12 so especially if you have a few people in your party, you're going to save some money if you know ahead of time and can purchase. We weren't sure what we're going to do today, so we're doing a little little last minute, so we're going to have to pay full price today. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> a corn crib. Is it stores all your years of corn through the winter? Okay. Um, and the center part is ventilation so that they don't get moldy and gross. Okay. And then we unscrew the panels over there and we shovel it out bit by bit. Um, thankfully we don't do cob corn anymore, we just do shelled corn. Okay. So we take it up to the distillery next door and we dry it. Um, but it, we used to take tractor buckets full of corn cobs and go and put them through an old fashioned hand sheller that we put a motor on. and it took ages to shell the corn to feed the animals with so it's much faster now but this is one of the coolest things we have so that's really cool thank you i love your earrings so. too thank you they're gorgeous all right so we just paid to get in through there they have a little gift shop maybe we'll show you later we just learned about the corn thank you hannah <laughs> Great and here. uh we're gonna head this way to the field yeah. and see the sunflowers so what we're here for let's go see them <laughs> we can see all of them way out there, but there's a lot of beautiful things right here in front yeah. of us. I see um, homemade ice cream ahead. <laughs> homemade ice cream. Oh, there's a truck over there. Oh, yeah. And more chickens. Chickens. Um, that was so fun that we got greeted by a chicken. Yeah. I made my day. Um, it's a beautiful day today. It's gorgeous. It's going to be better. August mm -hmm. 1st, 2023, Hello, and the high today is 74 degrees. Yeah. And it's perfect. There's a breeze. Yeah. Like, can you see the breeze? We've had a lot of rain, so this is very welcomed, and we're yes. gonna take advantage of it. <laughs> we're at Couple House Farms in Lee, New Hampshire, and we're gonna take this walk all the way down here to the sunflowers. Oh, look, there's a cute little RV here. It's already is so Is this pretty. a little tag along? We had one of these at our RV park. So they're so cute. So Love cute. It. We do live in an RV. And we're currently work camping here in New Hampshire, and we're trying to hit up all the festivals we can. Like, oh, festivals are so fun. It's very different than we're from South Florida, yeah. beneath your channel. So things like this don't really, they're not in, in the South Florida area, yeah. so it's, we're taking advantage. Oh, look at the wagon out there. Sorry, I just got excited. <laughs> oh, the wagon, there's kids playing on the wagon. Wait, 
How fun. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a lemonade cold brew stand. How cute. Oh, that's what it is. I love this. Wow. Oh, pours and petals. How adorable. This is so cute. Love it. They got lemonade, cold brew coffee. So many flavors of lemonade. Mm, I may have to get some iced coffee. Wow. Pistachio. Okay. Time out. <laughs> Time out. All right, I might get a nice coffee after we see the sunflowers. I don't want to carry it around and try to film and everything. And it's just so cute. It's like, I feel like we want to get something. They have this tent here with uh, picnic tables underneath, and this is, looks like where the live music takes place on the weekends. And then also over there where the tents are closed because they're not open today is um, some of the food options. I was reading the menu. Sounds amazing. They have fresh roasted corn right from the farm. Oh. They do it with different toppings. Oh, sounds that sounds amazing. amazing. Barbecue sandwich, burger, so something for everybody. So, so that's cool if you're here on the weekend. You can oh, really take advantage of Should have came on the weekend. Yummy eats. <laughs> Dang. Here's a pond. It's a little green right now. <laughs> a little green. <laughs> Definitely. All the pollen, I'm sure, from the sunflower. <laughs> but we're making it out to this massive sunflower field. Wow. It's so pretty already. Look at this. So beautiful. I can't wait to be in it. Hopefully there's no bugs. So we're just getting up close to the sunflowers right now and like it's impossible not to have like a giant smile yeah. on your face like when you look at these sunflowers. They're amazing. Wow. Here they are. Wow. They just go on and on. They are so beautiful. Leave a comment if you love sunflowers, y'all. I know these are a lot of people's favorite flowers. Like, how could you not? Like, first of all, there's tall as I am. Yeah, look. <laughs> Aaron's a good 5'2 uh, and a good day. <laughs> but they're Crocs 5'3. <laughs> all right, can we like walk in them? How close can we get? Oh, I wish they had sunflower seeds on them. I would eat them. We went picking blueberries not that long ago. I wish we could. Oh, this would be. I wish we could pick a sunflower. They are so tall. These ones out here are way, way taller than me. Those are probably like a good seven foot out there. And there's a cute door here that you could take cute photos with. You wanna take a photo, Erin? Let's take a photo with the door. I will insert the photo now. So beautiful in here. Just hanging out with the bees. The bees in the breeze. Erin, I feel like everyone should get to pick a sunflower and take it home. That would be like a mm -hmm. This look, these are the ones that are just opening. Look pretty cool. Yeah, that's why during this time is during when the most of them are bloom. That's uh -huh. this time of the year. Yep. That's why it's festival. Beginning of August. Now, yeah. You can see all the bees. Look at this. Yep. They're, just They're pollinators. Yeah. <laughs> Happy guys. Wow. It is so peaceful, so quiet. Um, there's not day. there's not too many people here coming during the week. I think. That was good. We're just missing out on the live music and stuff like that, but you could take endless, endless pictures in here. It's about 3.30 in the afternoon right now, and the sun's starting to go down a little bit, and it is making this time beautiful. It is beautiful. The petals look like they're glowing. It's mm -hmm. so bright. Look, even like the leaves. Look how big the leaves oh, are. Gorgeous. Huge. And they just go on and on it almost and on. Feels unreal because they're just so big and beautiful. Uh -huh. Just to be like kind of small. Oh, Aaron, them. this is beautiful. Say cheese. 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 There's so many great like photo spots here. You can just take endless pictures. Yeah, there's opportunities around every corner. Like this would be great with babies or like wedding photos. Yeah. Or photos Anything. 
Something it's like that. so beautiful. Okay. You want to take my picture? Yeah. Ready? Cheese! So we walked all the way around and we found this pathway that goes through them. How fun. <laughs> They're so pretty. Look at them. I do wish they had sunflowers, seeds on them. Maybe we can buy some in the gift shop. I know, we can, we can try to grow some. This is so pretty. We're walking in the sunflowers. I love it, I love it so much. There's just something you just feel so like connected. I don't know, it's, it gives you a little bit of, what's the good chemical in our brains? Dopamine or something? I don't know, it's, it's happening. <laughs> This little photo spot is so cute with this little frame, little doorway type deal. You got all the sunflowers back there. You're completely surrounded by them. Look. So beautiful. It's the backside, backside of, of sunflowers. <laughs> They're even pretty from behind. Yep. <laughs> so cute. That reference was to the Jungle Cruise in Magic Kingdom at Disney World, in case anyone was wondering. The ninth wonder of the world. The backside of water. This is so pretty. I can't get over it. Love it. This is the best time of day, best weather. We're lucky, blessed young ladies. Yes, we are. <laughs> like how I threw in young there? Young? <laughs> Compared to some. <laughs> I don't know why we're shing, but okay. We're hiding from the bees. <laughs> Aaron has to go pee. She's just trying to find a spot. I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's a good spot for you. No, they do have uh, porter potties. Oh, they're just endless. It's fun. It's like a corn maze, but it's sunflower. It's beautiful. I love that we can walk through them and not just like on the outside. This is even better. 360 sunflowers. Wow, and even like this, like from the backside, and they're like blowing in the breeze. It looks beautiful. It's so pretty. Love, Love this. It. So glad we came. <laughs> yeah. We just took another walk all the way back through all of the sunflowers, taking it all in on our own without filming, which is nice. And there are so many fun spots for pictures. Like, you can go Instagram crazy here if you wanted to. We're walking over to this whole other field over yeah, here. Yeah, there's a whole other section. So many. So we've been very curious about the direction the sunflowers are facing. So we're kind of curious, like, do they move with the sun? Like, what happens? So I had to Google it. Aaron got the 411, <laughs> yeah, y'all. 2023, y'all. You can, you think of something, you can find out immediately. So in the morning, okay, so my question was, do sunflowers move to follow the sun? In the morning, all the sunflowers will face east, the direction of the rising sun. As the sun moves, so will the sunflower heads to follow it. But... As summer turns to autumn and the sunflowers get big and ripe and heavy with seeds, they will stop moving until they are harvested. They will face only east. Mm, that's pretty cool. It is cool. Like mm -hmm. We're just chilling, taking in all the sounds. You can hear all the crickets. So pretty. Aaron's over here hanging up by the hay. New Hampshire is it's, it's pretty beautiful. Mm -hmm. Like it's definitely underrated because we didn't know much, but like everywhere we've gone, we're just like, holy beautifulness. Yeah. It's awesome. So we walked back over from the field and we're going to walk over by this pretty area over here. And there's this really cool wagon. <laughs> Welcome to the wildest ride in New Hampshire. The wildest ride in New Hampshire. There's, it comes with cup holders. There are cup holders up front. <laughs> you get to sit at least four people. Gonna go for a ride? For a normal size up front. And then the whole party in the back. You're ringing the bell? I'm ringing the bell. <laughs> this is so fun. Come on, look at this little archway they have over here. I wonder if these sunflowers are different. This one looks different. It's so fluffy. Oh, wow. It feels really cool. And I see there's like the darker colored one. 
I don't know if those are still sunflowers or if oh, they're different Oh yeah, flowers. let's go see those. Those are beautiful. <laughs> she got it all on her back. Yeah, and then look, these ones look different. Their leaves are like going the opposite direction. Ruby Eclipse. Ruby Eclipse wow, is the name here. This. That's so cool. Sorry, the sun is a. It's like almost like ombre. Yeah, but look at these over here. Don't go that way. These ones are called Florenza. Look, it's like maroon on the inside and then like a really light yellow. Pale, like really pale yellow. Pale tips. yellow. Wow, look at this one. This, this one is right? so, it looks like the sun. It's crazy. It's like, <sighs> wow. So cool. All right, what are these really dark ones called? I don't know, but look, the they, these are called little tigers. They're tiny. They're like newbies. Ooh, little tigers. Yeah, they're yeah. just starting off. I was like, yeah, look, you start to see like this has like the dark orange colors. There's another fat bee right there. Oh, wow, look at this one. That's like so dark. It's like dark, dark red. Look at dark, dark red. Wow. I'm glad we came over here. We're seeing so many different kinds. This is called Peach Passion. They're tiny. They're little ones. But yeah, and they, a lot of them, they all have the names on them, which is great for us because we don't know the names of we anything. We know nothing. <laughs> <laughs> we learn with you guys. Literally, most of the times we bring you along, we've learned that information that day. Yeah. So we're happy to share with you, and thank you for joining us. Have y'all ever been to a sunflower festival this before? This is the first time being in a sunflower field. Yeah. Of any kind. We went blueberry picking the other day. That was the first. Oh, now that we're was amazing. We hope y'all enjoyed that video. We had so much fun. The best blueberries ever. We made a couple. We, we played with them a little bit. Made a couple desserts. So now that we've kind of fine-tuned that, maybe Kim will prepare that for you on the channel. Uh, we don't have any blueberries left. We have to get some more. We have to go blueberry picking again. Yes, that's the thing here. On our way to this festival, I saw a farm that offered pick your own blueberries. That's the only way I can never eat blueberries from now on. We can't, spoiled. We're spoiled. We can't buy blueberries oh. from a store. It's like a whole other experience. If you've never picked your own blueberries, you have to do that before you die. I say a million percent. They sound a little morbid, but I'm being serious. Night and day, the difference between grocery store blueberries and picking your own. If this name is correct, it's Rogue Royale. And that's what these maroon looking sunflowers They're are so called. Cool. They're like a deep like a deep orange and some of them are really like look at this one this one's super maroon but then this one's really orange so like look like look at them right next to each other like this one's super red that one's a lot of red and then right here you have the orange the light going through those petals is so pretty with the sun coming down it is so beautiful in here and it's not hot it's crazy yeah it's gorgeous We're so lucky so we came across Kong and American Giant sunflower seeds and they're so tall and they haven't even like what's the right word bloomed yeah. the, the sunflower part hasn't happened yet if we lived on <laughs> if we were doing naked and afraid I would live in a oh you want to live in here circle. I'm not sure this would protect us from the um, elements uh, but it, it's got some shade <laughs> appreciate it it's, really it's pretty cool. cool you could come in here love it these are huge. These are like eight, nine foot tall already. So I'm, I'm assuming they're going to just keep growing. I'm pretty sure that's the tallest one. <laughs> we made it back over by the chickens. Heron's doing the chicken dance over here. Back, <laughs> back. <laughs> there's a cute there. Oh, there's one right here. Can you say hi? <laughs> he said, no, thank you. I don't know that chicken. I don't know that chicken. Been here before. <laughs> She's a funny looking chicken. Oh, looks like we're gonna go maybe find some animals. These horses are massive. Oh, I want to pet it. Don't leave. Don't leave. Wow. They are huge. Oh my god, you are so beautiful. Oh, hello. No, that one's a little small, but look, look at this. He is huge. There's some horse butts for you. <laughs> Hi. Oh, there's some friends over here calling for us. Hello. Hi. Hi, precious. Oh 
my god, you just made my day running up to me like that. Yeah. Oh, oh hello too. Oh hi. You're so sweet. Oh. I wish I had some food for you. So sweet. Hi. I'm getting all the kisses, Amy. Oh my goodness. The sweetest one. <laughs> He's just doing oh, it on my hi. finger. <laughs> they are oh so God. sweet. I love this. I love this. I love y'all. Okay, I gotta pet him. Bye. But I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave the sheep. They're so sweet. They're so sweet. But this is where those big giant horses were huge. And look at these giant things of hay. Ginormous. And there's literally just chickens everywhere on this farm. They're just running around. This rooster is frisky, man. Oh, frisky rooster. <laughs> <laughs> Flapping and puffing and doing all the things. Yeah, I'm talking about you. Yes, sir. What you doing? <laughs> okay, there, there he is. is. <laughs> He's frisky. All right, maybe we'll go uh, check out the gift shop on our way out. So right outside the gift shop, and it says they have corn mazes, pumpkins, wagon rides, and more. So I'm sure they have it going on during the fall. During the fall That'd be so fun. Amazing. A beautiful place. We really enjoyed ourselves yeah. today, though. This festival is going on July 29th through August 6th. They have a lot of fun. Uh, Farm fresh eggs. Oh, you want some fresh eggs, Aaron? Fresh eggs. They do have like a lot of like honey and stuff like that. The sunflower. This is so cute. I love, love the this. tank top. I love this color. I think oh, that's, that's very cute. The sunflower is so pretty on there. Oh, sunflower festival. This is really pretty too in this bag. So cute. Everything sunflowers. Oh yeah. It's really fun. I gotta get it. I gotta get Erin out of here before she uh, <laughs> you don't finds something. something she wants to buy. Look at these sunflower earrings. Oh, that's adorable. They yeah. actually are super thinking cute. Those are really. Oh cute. my god, they're only twelve dollars. That's a great price. Wow. That's cute. It's really really cute. Aaron, I found the sunflower seeds. They're chocolate covered. So if you plant them, they will grow chocolate covered sunflowers. Oh, right? is that how it works? I think so. Oh, yeah. Only $4. Let's, let's try it out. <laughs> so Imagine. Really <laughs> yeah, those are probably really good. Really, Put really. Put them back in. Oh, look at this. They have cool sodas. Ooh, green bee blueberry dream. Ginger buzz. Ooh, those sound really, really good. Honey soda. That sounds delicious. Ooh, sunflower oil. That's cool, Erin. Sunflower oil. That's cool. Oh, here's the prices. That little bottle is 10 bucks. Oh, no. Get away. Get away, get away, get away now. Erin, she found the jackpot. Uh-huh, I'm getting some. Oh. oh, she loves all these dip seasoning mixes I do. everywhere they're we go. They're so good and they're Actually, local and they're tasty. Yeah, normally they're really you good. You have not been disappointed yet. So no, I'm, I haven't. I'm getting it. Erin, of course, bought something, but we are heading out. And look. Hello, gorgeous. Can we say hi to Charlie? Okay. Tense and nip. Hi, Charlie. Hello. Gorgeous. Oh my god. Who are you? 21? You're 21 years old? And those are older, so he's probably a couple years older than Wow. Aww. You are handsome. Yes, you are beautiful. Oh my goodness. Hi. Just got some pets in with this beauty named Ice, who's 17 years old. <laughs> So I just wanted to show you all my purchase real quick. There's some, there you go. Potato, Potato salad, salad seasoning. seasoning. It's garlic, onion, dill, basil, chives, thyme, black pepper, absolutely no MSG, no sugar. So I want to play with this. I think I want to put it on some cauliflower or something and get creative with some yummy flavors. And I always love supporting local, you know, businesses, local farms, and I'm a foodie. So I like to try the local stuff. <laughs> we have had a great time here today. It was so fun. Beautiful, and... feels a little magical, a little whimsical. Mm -hmm. Got to see the animals. Yeah, that was my favorite part. Yeah, so cool. <laughs> like, on, and then again on the weekends, they have a lot more going on with some crafts and food and music. Mm -hmm. So if you're into more of that, I would say come on the weekends. It does cost a little more on the weekend. Again, if you know you're coming, try to get your reservation and book it online so you save yourself some money. You can do it at least 12 a.m. the day before you plan to go. 
Yep, but uh, it was so fun getting to see those sunflowers. So beautiful. So definitely worth the $12 we paid mm -hmm. each by far. Mm -hmm. Loved it. If you love this video, please hit your like button. If you are new to our channel or you have not subscribed, please subscribe. We're so close to 7,000. We'd love you all to join us on that mm -hmm. journey. And we will see you in the next episode. Bye, y'all.